Hello everyone, Takamasak here. Welcome to Clicker Heroes. Now, Clicker Heroes is an idle game. And for some reason, idle games over the last two, three years or so have just absolutely exploded, especially on Congregate. I don't know if that's the case with other game sites. I would have to assume so, because this is kind of like... Congregate seems like it gets all the games a little bit later. But this game was created by Playsaurus, Fragsworth, a... Uh, Dugog and new car smell. <laughs> so, just like any other clicker game, you have a certain thing. In this case, we have Finky, the level 1 rat with 10 HP. So we need to click, punch it in face, 10 times. And just like any other RPG, we can click it, a Sasquish, another Finky. Impossible. Oh, God, hi. Treasure chest. Well, let me beat treasure chest. Ooh, he gives signific significantly more gold. So we have... It's been ages since I played this, but I used to play this to death. Uh, I did go through the idle games phase, so... Uh, let's see. Uh, Sid the Helpful Adventurer just... Uh, this nice young fighter showed up to take some of those clicks off your fingers. I can hold in shift to buy ten. But I don't think I can afford ten. No... Oh, look at that damage. Look at that. A Catra? Okay. Yeah, like, usually in these games, the first person, if it's in a hero setup like this, the first one will increase your... Increase. Increase your click damage. Oh, we're doing fours of damage now. It'll increase... Why can I not say that word? Increase. Not increase, you dumas. Increase your click damage. So every time I give her another... Oh, look at that. 12 times in a second. That's uber. People still say uber, right? So, in this game, um, you just continuously progress. I mean, I'd assume the levels are infinite. I don't remember how high I got when I was actually active in this game. And as you can see, since then, my whatever has been reset. I don't know if, like, you clear your cache at some point. Uh, it'll reset your cache. Some of these games save in weird ways, but if we get any more heroes, we can get, uh, for example, Tree Beast, a series of slow wooden grunts from this creature indicates that you, indicates to you that it is friendly. It must have come from the Great Forest. So you can buy that, and then every hero after Sid uh, will basically auto-click for you. So it'll slowly drain, at, what is this, uh, damage per second, is that five? I think that's five, so. Yeah, still doing, oh, jeez. Oh, look at that stuff. We don't need an auto-clicker. Yeah, let's take a look at some of the other stuff. Um, after they get to certain levels, you can increase their damage. Among other things, like some characters, if I remember right, an angry potato. Will give you a, like additional gold bonuses. Like, like okay, you get a 50% gold bonus. And I, if I remember right, the fifth area will be like a boss. Like the fifth and... Yeah, every multiple of five will be a boss, so let's take a look at... Uh, there's tons of achievements to get what... I don't know what an... An ancient soul? I don't remember how that, but there's... In all these games, too, there's like an ascend system to eventually uh, complete 800 quests. What is a quest? Am I on a quest? Well, I don't remember exactly how that works, but there's like... I don't know if ascension is the right word for it. Is there another? No, it doesn't look like it. But uh, Like, you get a certain distance in the game, and you're not really going to be able to progress any further because you're not making enough gold, and you're just not doing a significant amount of damage anymore. So it kind of gives you a reset, but, like, each soul that you have... I think it starts at, like... Let me get past wave 5. Let me see if I get any hero souls for that. Oh, 30 seconds to murder it. Oh, man. Yeah, auto clickers are uh, <laughs> severely helpful with these kind of games. No, I didn't get any souls there, so maybe it's like the 10th levels you get souls. So uh, you can keep leveling up your homies and he'll eventually they'll start draining it way faster than I'm ever going to click. But at least the bonuses give you stuff, I thought. Oh. I'm, oh, oh, go back up, 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 up. I hope that's right, right there. So, 
It confuses me when there's a scroll bar in the game and a scroll bar on the side. It takes priority on the side. So, complete quests for rubies. Complete 208 five-minute quests. So it looks like a little bit more has been added uh, since I played. If I recall correctly, the treasure chests are just there to give you bonus money. Oh, God. That was quite a bit of bonus money. Even more DPS. So let's take a look here. You can get your... Uh, I don't remember what dark rituals were, but all this stuff usually is just to... Uh, after you ascend, uh, it just accumulates more and you do more damage to get further and get even more gold and get even further to collect more souls to get a better ascension to get even further and it just kind of repeats uh like i said this one is the highest rated right now on congregate it's sitting at a 4.4 so it's it's pretty good it's actually survived uh looks like recent patch notes were june 11 this game was made i want to say 2014 i don't want to scroll down uh screw it i will let's see uh uploaded here yeah 2014 august 6 2014 so they're still updating the game after all these years so that's what you look for in a decent idle game or really any game like they're actually paying attention to the game that what in a what a concept uh, what do they have in the shop oh, you can actually buy an auto clicker I, this isn't something i would ever spend money on i'm assuming free rubies are i don't know i'm not gonna not gonna click on it i don't really want to watch an ad but there used to be something... Uh, monster kills, treasure chest, mercenaries. Is that enough? Leroy Jenkins is buried. <laughs> That's new to me too. So there used to be something... It might be the mercenaries thing, but you could get like these weird creatures that will... Okay, this creature will give you extra gold, and it'll give you about 10% extra gold, and you can cash in your... I think you had to cash in your hero souls in order to uh, purchase upgrades for him. So like one would be more damage per second and one would be more click damage and another one would be uh, you get to skip the first couple zones or something like that. You could start at zone 80 or something along those lines. So there's a lot of variation to the game, I suppose, uh, in the way you could possibly set it up. I'm going to try to get through level 10. I'm absolutely murdering my mouse as it is. Urgh. Doing, what is this? Uh, currently, you have no auto clicker. Auto clicker is going to be used automatically. Level here is activated. Didn't click monsters. So. Yeah, you can get. Um, I don't really want to recommend cheating, but if you're going to play an idle game, there's no sense destroying your mouse. I don't think this thing has a high score table or anything. So, whatever. Auto clickers. There's one called. Uh, I think it's called Free Mouse Auto Clicker. And it's just like a red diamond, so that's how you know you get it. And you can set it to do. Like, double click every one hundredth of a second. So you can see how you can absolutely go flying. I don't think I have it on my PC anymore. Because, like I said, I haven't played idle games. Oh, we can almost get Brit <laughs> Brittany the Beach Princess. Hooray! Uh, once a prize fighter, Ivan can now be seen frequenting, frequenting taverns, challenging his... What is he? He looks like he's wearing a helmet. Well, that's interesting. Hey, treasure my chest. Oh god, it's a mimic. Look at that. Oh, we can almost hire Brittany. We might as well just save up for her, I suppose. She does. Are we going on an adventure? Like, you know, oh my god. Oh god. So, yeah, you need to kill ten. I've already clicked a thousand times. Oh dear me. So I'll just get through, like, level ten, because actually, once you've seen that, the monsters might vary a little bit, but... It's still the same idea. But yeah, like I said, man, these things have... Idle games have absolutely exploded. This, it has its own category on Congregate. There's just a million and a half games uh, you could possibly play. I played this one for ages. I probably stopped playing it like a year and a half ago to two years. And I started playing something called Trimps after that. And then I think that was right around when my computer died, the old tower. So all my data went with it, I think. Like, I, I couldn't recover the, uh... Recover the, like, the save. It gives you a big save password, and I couldn't recover that. So it's like, oh, I don't want to restart that. It sounds like a bad... Oh, I could go on. Can I beat the level 10 boss? I don't think initial damage is quite going to cut it there. So let us... 
Uh, okay, let us retry. All right, I'm gonna have to do some clicking here. The Sandball, level 9. Might as well get... Oh, look at that. 15 damn. Let me get, uh... Let me grab... Two more of those, I guess. Alright, so... That's gonna give me enough to get another one. So... Uh, the Emperor Scorpinch. Oh! Years and years of video games have given me quite the clicky finger. Alright, he's more than halfway, and we've got... Holy Jesus Christ! <laughs> Achievement beat Zone 10! Yeah, I don't think I want to deal with him. So at a certain point, you kinda... I don't know if it tells you. Some games tell you, it's like, okay... You're killing slower at level 11 than you are 9, but you're killing so much faster on zone 9 that you're actually getting more gold uh, to do that. Damn it, I did it again. Uh, it's right about there. It should be in view, so... Uh, who do we have? The Wandering Fisherman. He wouldn't tell you his name, but maybe you'd rather not know. His spear is good for catching fish and popping bloops. This reminds me of another game. I can't remember what game that is. Cloud something? Cloud... Cloudstone? I wonder if that's still a game. It used to be. I remember they screwed up and then ended up giving me a bunch of, like, the rare in-game currency, and then I never played it again after that, because the server was pretty much empty, and I had zero people to play with. Yeah, this game doesn't have a badge. I figured I'd just kind of show off an idle game. I haven't played any, like I said, on this channel. So here you go. If you're into idle games, give it a, give it a go, and... See how high you can get, and eventually you will get up to a s absurd amounts of money where it actually has to show you the scientific formula. <laughs> You've got 1.342 times 10 to the 800th power, or some absurd nonsense. But yeah, that's pretty much it. We've seen roughly everything except for the heroes and ascensions, but I'm not gonna. It's actually a smiley face moon. Oh, I didn't think it was going to click. I'm way up here, but I'm clicking on the... Oh, there's a big click area. But yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys want to play this, uh, as always, the video er, the video description will have the link to play this. So if you want to murder Dirge Beetle, or if you want to murder Finky, or if you want to murder the, the Gubulin. Gubulin? Or if you want to beat yourself a score pinch, that, that's your thing. So this was Click Your Heroes. I am Takamasak, and I will see you later.